So today I just wanted to share with you something that I've been enjoying lately, which is the zoodles with a pesto sauce. I will be giving you the recipe for the pesto sauce later in this video. Doesn't this look delicious? Oh my God, I have really been enjoying this. And um, I hope you guys enjoy it too. And let's get into how I make this. So the first thing I like to do is I like to get out my OXO spiralizer. I like it because it's very sturdy. I also like the fact that it has several different blades which you can use to, on different fruits and veggies to make different kinds of shapes. But for today, we are going to be spiralizing some zoodles or some zucchini into zoodles. And for that, we are going to be using the green blade. Now always make sure that you put down that gray lever. Once you set it to where you want to, you pull down that gray lever to keep it sturdy and stable when you're spiralizing. Then once you do that, you are ready to start spiralizing. I will put the link down below for the spiralizer if you're interested in getting this spiralizer. Then just get your just your zucchinis and cut the ends of your zucchinis. Today I'm only going to be doing two. Once you get that done, just put it in the middle and then just kind of squeeze it together. There you go. And then you can just start turning that lever around and start spiralizing. This only takes, takes less than a less than a minute to spiralize one. And then there you go. I got two of them done. And I have to admit, I mean, I am, I can actually eat the zucchini like this or even just whole by themselves. But I like to, you know, I'm a visual person. So seeing it like this, I mean, I can just eat them like that as a snack. Does that look pretty? Oh my God, that looks so pretty. Then I like to get some tomatoes and I like to just slice them in half. Those are uh, cherry small tomatoes. And then there are the greens that I'm going to be putting in there is, uh, what is that, parsley. But you can put any green that you like. You can even put uh, sprouts or anything else that you want. It's, you know, it's all up to you. You put in, in it whatever you want. I love tomatoes, so I put a lot of tomatoes in there. And I cut the leaves off of the parsley there, but I don't mind eating them, you know, because I, I keep most of, most of the stems in there. Then just go ahead and add the basil pesto and the recipe is right there on the screen for you. And I go ahead and put it all in there. And then with your clean hand, just go ahead and Push it all together and blend it in all. Yeah. There we go, there we go. Blend, blend, blend. Not blend, but stir, stir, stir. <laughs> then you put in the tomatoes and the parsley. And whatever else you want to put in there. And then you just with your hands again, I just kind of stir everything in together go. Oh my god, that looks so good. My mouth is watering. That looks so good. So good. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Oh my god, I'm going to give you some. You want some? Yeah, let me give you some. There you go, there you go. Here it comes. Oh yeah, yeah, there it goes. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I will see you guys on the next video.